Hi guys, it's Otto here and uh, in the previous video I showed you which motor you can use uh, to automate a Roman blind and today we're going to look at the two kits that we have um, that we've put together to easily automate your Roman blind um, and we're going to discuss the differences and um, what you can buy uh, to make it easy to, uh, to install your blind. Now first of all the Base is always the Sonfi Tilt 25 RTS motor, which is a 12 volt motor, um, and it easily fits into the head rail of, um, of a Roman blind. Now to fit the motor, uh, you need brackets, and we have three of the most common brackets included in the, in the basic package, um, and that should cover most uh, most um, Roman blinds. Um, if the, if you would have a need for a different set of brackets, we can always supply them free of charge afterwards. But this uh, normally these should cover uh, cover most of the uh, of the headrails that are available, and that's one important issue. Of course, uh, you do need a Roman blind with a headrail if you just have a um, the, the axle and uh, nothing else, so nothing to cover that, then, uh, then it won't work because the motor needs to be fit into something like, uh, like this um, head rail. Um, then there's of course the shaft adapters, um, because you need to, to connect the motor to the shaft to make the, uh, the blind roll up and down. So we've included three sets as well uh, for square and star shaped shafts. Um, and we have these little rings that allow you to fixate the, uh, the shaft as well so it doesn't come out of the motor when it's turning. Now that's basically the, the contents of the, uh, the basic package. Um, you need two more things actually to make it all work and that's uh, uh, some sort of power supply and a remote control and that's what we, uh, what we include in the complete package. Um, first of all the remote control, you needed to set the end limits and of course you, you need a link to the remote itself to make it work. Um, that's done with the, uh, when you program the motor and we actually include a, either a TELUS 1 or a C201 RTS remote control in the, in the complete package. Um, for the power supply we use this rechargeable wand and supply 10 rechargeable batteries and the wand is placed uh, close to the motor, it's actually connected with these two wires and we supply also the brackets um, to, to actually fix the, um, the tube to the wall. Um, so that's the complete package. So why do we have two packages? Well, first of all, uh, mainly for the remote control. Um, if you, for example, have more than one, if you have five, for example, then you wouldn't necessarily need five remote controls. Um, you don't want to use just one and put four in a drawer uh, that you have paid for. Um, so the better option then would be, for example, to take the five basic kits and then get a Tele 6, which is a six channel remote control with timer. Um, so we want to keep the options open for you and not have you pay too much for stuff you don't need. So that's the reason for two packages. Now if you have any questions, uh, we are still going to make a video about the, uh, the whole installation procedure, um, but as you can see, the amount of parts that you actually need is, is, is fairly limited. We have a few versions of, uh, of each part here, so what you actually need is, is a set of uh, head wheel brackets, the shaft adapters, the rings, the motor, remote control and the power supply, and that's it. So the installation procedure is fairly straightforward. Um, but we're still going to make a video about that in the, in the next few weeks. If you have any questions in the meantime or would like to order a kit, please let me know. They're very affordable right now, so it's, uh, it's definitely an option uh, to consider. Um, links are in the description, so um, if you want to send me an email, you can do so via the link provided. Um, and if you have any questions, do let me know. If you want to automatically be informed of the new videos we're making, do subscribe, because then you get a notification from YouTube telling you that we've created a new video. I look forward to seeing you in the next one, and thanks for watching.